Well, hello, fellow worm farmers. This is Larry again with the Wiley Worm Farms, and it's time to feed my worms one more time. And we're going to get right into the bin, and the bin that I've got here is bin number 600. I've tagged it as bin number 600. And uh, this bin is, is not one I bought, this one I created. Got a little bit of paper, I'm going to say that paper. And uh, I counted out 500 worms and put in this bin. And it looks like I got a pretty good number of worms here. What do I got here? Oh, that's some paper, that's some shredded. Probably what that is is coffee filters. Coffee filters shredded. Here's another one. Yeah, that's what that is. That's coffee filters shredded there. But it's uh, looking pretty good in here, Mr. Camberman. Got it looking good. It's growing. Now, I have made a mistake, folks. Uh, I'm going to tell you, if you stay in the worm business very long, or any business for that matter, you're going to make mistakes. This is the first bin that I've had out of six bins. This is the very first bin that I've had that I forgot to label it. The rest of them, I put a little piece of tape on the end and label every one of them except for this one. So I'm going to fluff it up here real good. And uh, they're looking good. They're looking pretty healthy here. Quite pleased with this bin here. We'll make me a little room right here in the middle because I got a little bit of <coughs> table scraps left. I want to feed them. My table scraps consist of some apple peeling. And I got a little chunk or two of potato. You know, we had some potato for lunch. Had that left over, so I'm going to feed that to more worms. Cover that up, get the, get the odor out of here, get this thing out of the way to start with. And uh, got, again, I got some paper I hadn't separated here. All right. Cover that up a little bit, and uh, I'm going to give them some, some worm chow to go with that. Now, this is... This is chicken feed pellets, folks, is what this is. And I started doing this uh, for a couple of reasons. Number one, I started running out of uh, kitchen scraps. We've got so many bins now. <clears throat> we don't have a kitchen scrap for all of that. So I started feeding this. And this is ground up eggshells, all that is. That helps them digest it. Give them a little bit of that, not a whole lot of it, but a little bit of that. And also, I give them a little bit of coffee grounds. Every morning when I make coffee, I save my coffee grounds and feed them to my worms. And speaking of coffee fillers, there's another one. I'm just going to put it right on top there. I may have to go to local coffee shop and get some more ground because <clears throat> I'm starting to use more grounds. So here we go, folks. Put the, put the uh, newspaper back on here. It's good and wet and soggy. If they run out of food before my next feeding, then uh, I'll have some newspaper from the feed from. So this just about wraps this up for today. Get my bubble wrap in here. My bubble wrap, if you're new to the worm business, bubble wrap really helps keep your moisture in. Now, I had a problem with dryness in my bed before I realized the importance of bubble wrap, but I hadn't had any problems since then. All right, so uh, I have a few worms for sale, and I will let these go at $59.00. Per pound, that's these are pure red wiggle worms. I guarantee these would be pure red wiggle worms, and I guarantee them to arrive at your place all alive and well. So I'll put a link down at the bottom for for my uh, worms. I've got a, another business too. I'm in the taxi business as well, and uh, I'll use a link to that 
where you can easily pay there. But when you do, just make sure that you include an address where you send these to. But these are ready. I've got two or three, two or three thousand that I can sell. So if you're interested, just uh, drop me a note or get on there and, and buy those, and I'll get them to you. Also, my other worm videos I've got, I've got approximately 100 worm videos now. Been in business. I started January the 17th of last year, 2023. And today, by the way, is March the 5th of 2024. So March is marching on. Here we go, folks. This is it for today. We'll see you next time. This is Larry again on Wild Worm Farm. Have a great day, and we will talk to you later.